Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for bout number 18 of the show. This bout will be for the ISKA Interim World Title Bout. So ladies and gentlemen, for the first entry of the World Title Bout this evening, please welcome into the black corner, Jeremy Montero. Jeremy Montero! And now, ladies and gentlemen, please raise the roof in welcoming into the ring his opponent this evening. Fighting out of the wide corner, Nico Carrillo! Nico Carrillo! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this ISKA World Title Bout is scheduled for five three-minute rounds and will be contested under A-class Muay Thai rules in the 65 kilogram division. Over to your referee. The stakes have just got high here at Combat Fight Series. We are live from Fairfield Halls, Croydon. Jeremy Montero and Nico Carrillo fighting for the ISKA world title at 65 kilos. Good one. Round one. And we're underway. Oh, you bet it is. Montero, black gloves, Carrillo, white gloves. What an entry to the ring from Carrillo as well. Came down from the back of the hall, danced through the crowds. Paid his respects. Now it's time for one of these men to earn a world title. 
and Montero. In fact, both these guys have stopped Mo Abdurrahman. Montero just did it, and obviously Carrillo did it before on here. This should be a good matchup. Uh, both exchanging teeps to the body. And a solid body shot there from Montero. Oh, Carrillo going high with the kick early on. Lovely left kick. Carrillo looks massive at 65, doesn't he? He does, doesn't he? Well, if you look at the shape Montero's in, he looks in really good shape, but Carrillo looks taller and wider. <laughs> so sharp. left hand there by Montero and then attempted the teak to the face decent right as well with the leg locked up but then Carrillo comes back with a right hand of his own go into the clinch nice and taking the back knee in the back and then sweep mm. yeah he's done well there hasn't he because Montero looked like he had the early advantage Lovely push kick. Oh, vicious body shot from Cabrillo. Nice Ooh. movement though from Montero. Yeah, he stepped back out of the way of that. Looked like he was going to throw a head kick. Oh, massive right hand from Carrillo, Montero just looked downstairs for a second. And Carrillo took advantage up top, end of round one. Here we go for round two. The data gathering done. Expect a tempo increase here. When we, were, when we were talking about feints earlier, Carrillo is great at it. Yeah. Watch him push that lead leg teep out. And then he just lifts the knee slightly, showing he's going to teep, steps in and uses it. Well, right at the end of the first round, Ooh. he fainted with the teeth and then came over the top with a really nice right hand that landed on Montero. Just changed his eye line, didn't he? That's something that the fighters have got to be so aware of, and so often we'll see them with that laser focus forward, but using the up and down peripherals to try and see the attack that's coming, whether it's the kick. All the hands or the elbows, just got to have your wits about you at all times. Oh. Lovely work there from Montero. Yeah, he's got great awareness, hasn't he? We've seen his head movement, his body movement, getting him out of trouble, and of course, making Carrillo miss. Oh, nice right hand from Montero before engaging in the clinch. 
Carrillo trying to get that knee at the middle but can't get there and now Montero takes the back. Nice work from Carrillo there in the clinch. Oh, knee from Montero but then Carrillo with heavy hands. Oh, Montero again. You don't want to entirely Ooh. rely on body movement to get you out of trouble, but he does have great reflexes when he sees the shots coming. Carrillo looking for that downward elbow. What's Carrillo landed there? Four knees without reply from Montero. Yeah, knees round the back. Similar style with Stevie Urban earlier. JP training them well up there in the clinch. Lovely work and an elbow landing there from Montero. There's that crack across the cheek. Shaping up as a nice bout. Again, those knees from Carrillo, nice. Still only in round two, though. Lots of time for Montero. Takes the back. To right this. <laughs> Yeah, as you say, early days still. They're shaping up to be lovely. <laughs> but at the end of round two, the crowd enjoying it here. Hope you are at home. Two down, three to go. three in the opening two Nico Carrillo has been the pace setter but Montero sets his stall out at the Ooh, of look the at the two. balance beautiful balance and control from Carrillo there yeah takes two to the inside of that lead leg and then just shrugs his shoulders he's got a great IQ Nico Fight IQ. Don't know about his intelligence. Oh, he looks a bright boy. He does. Joke society's quality in there. Okay. See the way he reads fighters. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Beautiful shot. Well, Montero went down because he was off balance, but he ate an elbow on the way down. Nico hasn't even come out of second gear, though, look. Still chilling in there. Beautiful body kick. Answered straight back. They look like different weight groups in there, though, yeah. look. Nico's huge at 65. Nice again, takes the back. It's not just the size, though, it's the strength with it as well, doesn't it? It's very efficient. I wonder where you were going. <laughs> Uh, readjustment there for Nico Carrillo. Just talking about the feints though. Oh. Exchanging kicks to the midriff. Oh, nice body shot there from Montero. But just talking about the feints of Nico Carrillo. Just those little movements. Keep your eye on how Montero reacts to them because his natural movement is to just go backwards and to disengage. And that's Carrillo just winning those little psychological battles. He faints really well, doesn't yeah. he? Oi, look 
at that. Beautiful. Got swelling under the left eye, Nico. Yep. Definitely caught at least one, isn't he? Lovely body kick. Drops his hands for a minute just yeah. to bait him in. Goes for that left elbow. Takes the back again. Last few seconds. Four. Here we go for round four. Another composed display in round three from Nico Carrillo, wasn't it? Lovely timing on his body kicks, Nico. Oh, it's a world title fight. Oh, Oy. Oh, Montero Oy. comes his form, two flying knees. Nice to see him as the aggressor. We're into the championship rounds now, four and five. Nice sweep. Two good rounds here, and you leave as an ISKA world champion. Oh, that Jaime Montero. Just gonna have the gear as we expected he would, so we know we've got, we know he's got the quality to do. Oh. Heavy contact there from Montero. Oh, cut. Yep, cut. And it's quite a big one above the left above eye. Above the left eye, yeah. Nico Carrillo. Keep your eye on this. Montero has turned up the temperature here in this world title fight. And a decent welt under right in this corner of his eye as well. Well, at the moment, the early signs, is that's a lovely throw from Carrillo, though, is oh. that the blood is dripping away from the eye. This is good news. He's not pouring at it either. Yeah, it's not bothering him. It's nice and clean. Oh, Wait, heavy right, right hand. hand from Nico Carrillo. And then the push kick to back it up. Oh, lovely body kick. And another, he's gone right down left on the body kicks after landing. Crunching right hand, huge credit to Montero, he just ate it. And that feint. But Montero realising the best way to counteract the feint is just to come in and come forward. Oh, Carrillo Ooh. ducked the kick, then Montero came in with the knee. Brilliant round. And that sets up a stunning fifth and final <laughs> round for the world title.
One to go. Fifth and final round for the 65 kilos ISKA world title. Jeremy Montero against Nico Carrillo. Montero. His sportsmanship. Yeah, beautiful sportsmanship. And Montero has timed his comeback perfectly. Carrillo has been consistent throughout the rounds. Both men have enjoyed it in there. And Carrillo has enjoyed it from the moment that he entered the ring. He's making the most of this opportunity, but which of these men is going to get their arm raised as a world champion? Two and a half minutes, and the way these bouts are scored, it could be the man who has the best two and a half minutes, who leaves with the belt. What a kick there from Carrillo to drop Montero with pure force. Beautiful push kick. Seems to have done a tidy job on that cut in between rounds as well. They've stopped it bleeding. But any kind of impact on it, it's so deep. Oy. It'll open back up. That elbow from Carrillo. The way he caught the leg as well. Just showed him his intent and then executed. Montero's corner here screaming. Well, final two minutes. High work rate, good execution. It's going to be the difference, isn't it? One of these men's going to be a world champion. Oh, what Lovely. a sweep from Montero. Well timed. Low kick there from Montero, who takes his man down. Oh, 90 seconds, the jab there from Carrillo sends Montero backwards. I think both of these men got to be feeling fatigue as well. Oh, Again, Montero. Lean back by Montero. Oh, lands a right hand there, Montero, on Carrillo. He drops his hand. He just drops his hand to lead him in to clinch there. Oh, he doesn't want to be rubbing his head in there too much. Especially, especially oh, on lovely. that side as well. Lovely turn by Nico there. Again, catches the leg and wants to get that right hand away. That's where he feels the power is. Great body kick from Nico. Oh. And then goes upstairs. Final 30 seconds of this boat. Nico Carrillo, so relaxed out there, Montero. Perhaps going to chase it in the final 20 seconds, try and take it out of the hands of the judges. Huge smile on the face of Nico Carrillo. The crowd chanting his name here in Croydon. Final few seconds. And the bell goes at the end of five great rounds as Montero raises his hand. But Nico Carrillo struts around like a man who thinks he's a world champion. Oh, it's all showmanship, isn't it? The judges have already written their scores down. It's going to go one. to the scorecards, though. Well, this one's gone the distance. Great fight. Really, really enjoyable fight. Great technical fight as well. Carrillo, so much to like about him. That kick, absolutely fantastic. Montero cut his man open. And we are seconds away from crowning an ISKA 65 kilo world champion.
Ladies and gentlemen, after five sensational rounds of Muay Thai action, your ringside judges have reached unanimous decision. So let's hear it for the new ISKA World Champion in the white corner, Nico Carrillo! But it's Carrillo's done it up. And after all the posturing, all the confidence. And let's raise a roof from the runner up, Jeremy Montero! Five fantastic rounds and a white ISKA World Championship belt around his waist. He must feel on top of the world, Dave Benson. Certainly, you can see the emotion kicking into his face there. What a beautiful belt that is. Beautiful fight, though. Beautiful belt, beautiful moment. Nico Carrillo is a world champion.